Good morning, Americans. This is your private alien, and Bubba had to use a Santa suit because it's rainy out there, and he outgrew the other one, so I have to buy him another one. So I had to use that one today because it was rainy out there for him. It's about 60 degrees today here in Georgia. Going to be 70-something close to that, but rain. And I wanted to do a message to you Tulsi supporters. I see the DNC is trying to really get her out of the DN, uh, the uh, process, aren't they? They're, they're really trying hard. But how would you Tulsi supporters view this? And if you do, one of you pass it on to the Tulsi staff, okay? Because uh, you got a huge problem on immigration here. And here's your favorite alien's suggestion. It looks perfectly constitutional. And... I don't know if you guys as Democrats supporting Tulsi would accept it, but you Tulsi supporters let me know, okay? So here it goes. My suggestion for eliminating your immigration problem here would be to form a 18 to 24 month moratorium on admitting people to the United States that are coming in for humanitarian and other reasons uh, and period if you got a visa you can still come in but visa should be suspended for 18 to 24 months and for the first 60 days of that period you should put out there that all illegal aliens here in the country whether you came in with a visa and stayed and became an illegal alien or you came in illegally should go to your local ICE office and register. ICE will do nothing to you. Okay? And you should get together with the Secretary of Homeland Security and the Secretary of State and issue you a number similar to your Social Security number and an ID card. Saying that you're an illegal alien waiting for your disposition and the U.S. Uh, immigration judge court system. So nothing's going to happen to you. ICE can't arrest you, can't deport you until your status is determined either permanent or uh, you can stay or you have to go. You can still work and... You can go to the ICE, can go to the employer and say, okay, how much are you paying this guy if he's working? And pay him at least 75% of U.S. wages. Remember, he's still an illegal alien. So he really has uh, no standing here other than constitutional rights because of the ID. And he's waiting for his disposition on the U.S. courts, which you know are so backed up, it's not even funny. So, uh, with that ID, they have a right to go to school if they want to, as long as they pay. But if they're working, you have to, the employer, like they do for you guys, on the 941 form every three months, they have to deduct from every paycheck a certain percentage, like they do for Social Security and Medicare for you guys. And put it into a fund for illegal aliens. That way they don't cost you. Because right now, they're costing you and submitting nothing to the system. This time, if they're working, you know, the system can borrow, I mean, take that money, from that fund, whatever, for that person. Whatever it is. Uh, medical. And stuff like that. Also... Uh, and this is just a cursory note review. It can, it's got to get it more in detail. But uh, the employer matches it just like they do in the, in the Social Security and Medicare for you and creates that fund. And once the disposition of that person is done, is okay. If after the 60 days, you still got people here that didn't go see ICE and didn't get their ID number, then you can deport them. Because they had an ample time to get there and get themselves 
registered with no further action with the United States until their uh, case was disposed of in U.S. courts. This is just a cursory. There's a lot more to go to this. But what do you think, Tulsi supporters? Would you, if Tulsi presented this program, would you support it? Let me know. And if there's a supporter there, just email it to Tulsi and tell them to contact the alien. I can give her more information on this suggestion I have, but it's the humane and less costly way of getting rid of this uh, problem with the illegal aliens. What do you think? Because some are going to stay, some are going to go. But you need them for your economy. You can't sidestep this issue. Anyway, this is your favorite alien. And Bubba here, good day.